Dizzy. Uh, uh, huh? Hello, K.O. Ah! Dizzy! I heard your internal monologue. I would be happy to fix Rad's van. I can hear both of you, and you're not fixing anything. I can understand your hesitation, but I would be honored to bring your van back to its former glory. In fact, with my help, we can make your van into something spectacular. Ugh, that's yours now. It's not mine anymore. I simply made some small modifications. You know what it says on the side of that van? Rad's van, not Rad and Dendy's van. <laughs> no buts! That van is my pride and joy. How can I be proud of it if it isn't mine? Whatever. I'm going to bed. Dendy, you can sleep over too if you want. Just don't touch anything. Hmm. Rad is being very unreasonable. Why? Aw, oh, Dendy. Rad's van is like his baby. You don't want someone to tell you how to make your baby better, you know? If I could improve a child, I would. Regardless, he is acting irrationally. If he would simply allow me, I could fix it with ease. Hmm. It's often said that it is easier to ask for forgiveness than permission. Yes. Come with me. No! <laughs> Whoa! She looks brand new! But how? You, uh, were sleepwalking last night, and, um, sleep fixed your van? Huh. Cool! <laughs> I didn't realize I was that good. Whoa. You actually fixed it. Looks pretty decent, Rad. I mean, it looks better, but it's still just a van. Just a van? That's pretty big coming from Tugboat Annie over there. <laughs> My tank is from the future. You wouldn't even understand the tech it takes to make it better than your van. Yeah, well, I don't understand a lot of things, but I know that my van was made with pure love and pure muscle. Uh, and you can't beat that. Uh.